common burdock is a valuable plant to foragers, especially as a source of roots. Now, the stems and leaf stalks are also edible, but it's mainly the roots that are of interest. Common burdock roots can be eaten raw or cooked, but in my opinion, they're better cooked because cooking brings out their starchy flavor and softens their texture. For the most part, anything you can do with commercially grown carrots, you can also do with burdock roots. And burdock roots that you gather from the wild are just as big as commercially grown carrots, sometimes even bigger. That's what makes them so valuable to foragers. So, how do we find common burdock? And how can we be sure that it really is what we think it is? Well, with a height anywhere from 4 to 10 feet tall, a forager shouldn't have any trouble finding this plant. And all the burrs covering it should make it easy enough to identify. Common burdock is what botanists call a biennial plant, which means that it lives for two years. In its first year, it looks like a cluster of giant, hairy, heart-shaped leaves rising out of the ground. And in its second year, it develops thick stems, purple flowers, and of course, the spiny burrs for which it's named. As with most biennial plants, gathering the roots should be done any time before the stems develop, because after that point, the roots become tough and woody and you can be sure that gathering the roots is a workout.